Yeah. I came with my soap. Okay. I'm burnt. It's obvious. I went to the beach yesterday and a bitch took a nap and didn't cover myself with a towel. But the wind felt so good. I love the breeze. But you know, whatever. We'll get through it. Um, I've been putting like lotion and African shea butter on it. So it's gonna help. Because African shea butter is literally the shit. The shit. For the body. Honestly. Honestly. So I bought some stuff on Nasiga. I'm gonna insert some stuff here that I just bought at like random places this past weekend but um let's get started so kind of like random but i just wanted to add this here but i just got this elta md sunscreen the uv elements broad spectrum spf 44 and it's tinted and i kind of like it it's pretty good so far it's been working really well and i like it it doesn't make me as like shiny not shiny but like dewy as the super good one that one is still like an, a good every day but i've been using this one and this one is really good too um i think this one is a mineral sunscreen but i'm not sure no i think this is chemical whatever it's pretty good i like it anywho let's get started okay so your girl did some shopping and let me tell you how much I spent on Nasty Girl. <laughs> I spent one twenty three and nineteen cents. Of course, I did afterpay, so I felt better about my life. Um, so, if you don't know what afterpay is, it's basically um, like basically payment installments that you can do it's four times every other week. So it takes the whole total divided by four and then you pay it like charges the car your card that you input um every two weeks basically which is pretty fire <laughs> so for this order since i paid um well i spent 123 dollars and some change i'm doing after pay <laughs> and i'm paying Oh my god, how much am I paying? Oh, I'm paying $30.80 every two weeks. Which doesn't make, like, psycholo bleh, psychologically, it doesn't make me feel as bad for spending my money, you know? Hold on, sorry. Anywho, let's get started. So the first thing that I bought is this top that I'm wearing right now, and it's super cute. Oh, I'm just busting my ass just now. So it's like a simple tank top, and it has, like, these little, like open sides with like the little strings and I just think it's super cute and like super sexy I really like it it's very simple but it's like a little twist on a regular regular tank top I can wear it with jeans a skirt like literally it's just a tank top so I think it's really cute for the summer if I want some just like you know I feel like this is like a really inspired like model off duty tank like that's why I bought it I was just like oh this is cute like it's simple but there's like certain details about it that just makes it stand out <laughs> so the next thing that I got from Nasty Gal was this um little corduroy um top it's like big and oversized um i'll insert clips of everything that i've bought here just to show you but it's so cute i think it's really comfy it's very lightweight it's not like a heavy corduroy material so i feel like for like the chillier days like when it's 70 degrees in the summer or i can transition this into the fall as well as winter it's super cute I love it. The next thing that I bought, I got this cute front tie cardigan from Nasty Gal, and it was, it's so cute. It's definitely a little warm, so I want to say if you live in an area where it gets chillier at night, then this is definitely good, or if you're going to the beach and then you want a cute little cover-up for when it gets chillier and windier um, as the day goes by, like at the end of the day, then I think this is like really perfect, and it's so cute definitely a little bit um 
thick and warm for the summer but I feel like I can wear this in the fall or like transition it however I want in the winter and it's really cute it has like a front tie so it like it's very sexy it's like scandalous it opens at the bottom and it has a little v-neck and I don't know there's just something like really cute about this it's like a cardigan but it's not grandma cardigan and you know it's cute it's cute so the next thing I got was these um nasty gal jeans and they're like very boyfriend very 90s inspired i feel like it's all wide leg through the whole entire thing it's not meant to be fitted it's very big on me at where the waist is i rise them up to make them high-waisted and plus to fit my length more um i like things high-waisted just because it makes me look taller um and i paired it with so my jack must bag i used the bag strap as a belt just to um basically like tighten the jeans around my waist but yeah it's super cute super 90s I feel like this is also inspired by like the 90s model of duty look I feel like that's the vibe that I was going for with this um just pair it with like a simple cardigan like that cardigan that I showed you earlier and or like this tank top or just like you can it's jeans you can literally pair it with everything so yeah and then what else did I get? Wait, is that all I got from Nasty Girl? Oh, I got these um leather pants, but I returned them because like they were huge on me. They were a size two, and that was not a size two. Like I don't know who that was fitting, so I had to return them. And I love Nasty Girl because it's free returns, so that's lit. Um, but other things that I bought this past week that aren't from Nasty Girl, I got this R U M I cute leopard slip dress it's like sheer material and it's really cute i feel like it's you can girl i did have to pay on this too because this shit was 120 dollars all right it is 120 dollars and girl i'm making use of every single everywhere i can wear this i'm gonna wear it so i wore it as a beach like recently to the beach recently as a just like a cover-up and i can like you can wear it to dinner you can wear it out it's pretty sheer but like i feel like you can't tell when you actually have it on um if you want to be safe then you can just wear like some black undergarments or some nude undergarments under um like a tube top spank situation going on like you can literally get it at spanks or target or wherever so the straps were a little too um like long for me so I just knotted it here I don't know if you can tell I knotted it and then I just sewed the extension up so I didn't cut it off and then knot it just in case like you know I want to extend it again but yeah simple tailoring just so it can fit me a little better so that one was really cute I love this slip dress so the next thing I got is something, these are all really simple pieces that, I like simple pieces, like I'm very minimalistic but at the same time I can be really fucking extra, but on an everyday basis I'm very minimal and I like to buy things that I can wear with different things. So I got this really like simple basic tank top from Aritzia and I can just pair it with um, jeans, a skirt, um, shorts, like anything it's legit it's legitimately just a tank top but it's so soft the quality of like aritzia basics and just aritzia like clothing in general is just so good but yeah this tank top is just really fucking soft and you need it like it feels amazing on the skin so the next thing i got um i got it from urban so urban had a 40 dollar no 40% off sale this past weekend so I went and got this cute little um ruffle top and it's adorable it was literally $20 and then 40% off so I think I paid like $11 so so bomb so like it's super cute super basic it's very soft and i think you, i can like really make use of it this summer just you know for basics and i got the white one just because you know I feel like when I'm tan, like white pops. So yeah, I can pair, pair this with anything. I can wear, pair it with shorts. I can pair it with skirts. I can pair it like slip skirts. That, that would be so cute. Jeans, like literally such a cute, basic, simple top. And the last thing that I got this weekend was these boots from Urban Outfitters. They're like cowboy inspired boots. Um, they were $50 and then 40% off. So... I paid like around $30 for them. It wasn't even that bad. It was, it's so 
cute. Um, I'm pretty sure this is faux leather. I mean, it's like Urban Outfitters. I really don't think it's real leather. But it has like the little like detail, like stitching over here, the cowboy boot. And it's just really cute. It has this cute little low heel and the pointed toe. And I just thought it was really like a cute shoe for the summer and then a cute transition from the fall. I really like these because when I saw them, they kind of reminded me of like these boots that I saw from Saint Laurent so I was just like oh my god these are so cute and then I tried them on and they're really comfortable they're very lightweight when you wear them so I really enjoy these so that was a really good steal um but yeah like other than that I didn't really get much I just bought like a lot of simple basics um but yeah um if you want to see more videos subscribe comment like this video and make sure you follow me on my Instagram to see more looks Thank mm -hmm. you.